So, but what if you're attending the bar at the nightclub you work at and the hottest guy you've ever seen comes in? He's obviously rich. The tailoring on his suit does not come cheap. And he didn't blink twice when you told him the price of the scotch you ordered. It's a busy night, so you can't devote a lot of attention to him. But you notice he's always watching you. And you wish you didn't like it so much. You have a feeling he's the kind of guy that would get you in trouble if you let him. Because you have a history of falling hard for guys like this, and it always ends up with you obsessed and heartbroken. So you know to stay away. But you can feel his eyes on you like they're his hands. He's possessive with his gaze. He watches when you throw back tequila shots with your coworkers in celebration of your graduation from business school. He watches while you flirt with another patron who gives you his number. He watches you when you toss that number in the trash. Did you do that with every number you receive? He asks you. You know where this is going. Are you trying to figure out if I'd throw away your number? And he laughs. <laughs> Maybe. I wouldn't throw yours away, you tell him. I wouldn't take yours at all. You want to know why? You have him where you want him, intrigued. You lean forward so close that you can smell the scotch on his breath mingled with his expensive cologne. And you tell him, because you're looking for something temporary, something fun to play with, and I get attached. Now, doesn't that just scare you shitless? He gives you the smallest of smiles. You, Elena Withers, do anything but scare me. It takes you a good five minutes after he leaves to realize you never told him your name. This is how Fixed on You begins. It's book number one in my best-selling fix series. If you want this hardcover special edition with a gold foil, you better order now because they are going fast.